Hey guys, it's MJ. I thought we'd do a little bit of vlogging today. Um, I think this might even be my first vlog. I know I've had like sit down chit chats and stuff like that. Um, you're on a selfie stick, so if you're like all over the place, it's just that. Um, so I thought we'd give a shot at vlogging because it's my day off and uh, I got some stuff to do and I thought you'd like to share the day with me. So uh, stay tuned if you're interested in what I do during the day and uh, if you're not interested in what I do during the day, Jared from Two Face posted some good stuff this week. Um, I, I That's actually kind of how I start my day is I had a really bad anxiety night, just really bad. And I was, I was a mess. I was a total mess. I woke up this morning just completely freaked out. And I had some coffee and went back to bed and I was like, nope, nope, bad day, bad day, bad day, bad day, bad day. And I breathed, I talked to my husband a little bit, and I calmed down, and then I said, well, what's going on? Well, Too Faced posts like inspirational shit once in a while, and I just, I really enjoyed what he posted today. And it was about, you know, creativity as a muscle, and you know, it was about working that muscle, and how they created the Too Faced uh, mascara, and I really, that helped. I watched a few more of his videos, I really enjoyed listening to him speak. And I said, we're going to take the dogs to the park. I'm going to leave this house and we're going to take dogs to the park. Someone's very excited they heard the word park. She's sitting next to me like, oh God, mama, park. I love the park. So uh, that's what we're going to do. And I'm going to take you guys with me. Stay tuned. This right here is our collie dog, Salty. And this is Dauphine. Dauphine is a Mullins Feist. I've had her since she was about five weeks old. I got her when I was in college. And you're fine, you can wait a moment. Look pretty on the camera. And Salty Dog we got as a rescue when he was just over a year old. They're both 10 right now. Dauphine, you can sit. Oh, I know it's terrible. They know that they're going to the park and they are super duper excited. Well, he doesn't look excited. That's because he is kind of a nervous old man. But she's really excited. Cause are we gonna go? to the park. Duffy Park! She's like, yes, yes, we're going to the park. We're going to the park. And he's over here like, I really hope we're going to the park. That'd be really cool. We are gonna go snag a coffee before we take the dogs to the park. The, um, it, I'm in New England. It is mid-March and which for New England means that all you're gonna get is crazy pants wind and the wind has been legit crazy pants we just pulled up to the hockey rink um i take my dogs to a local outdoor um roller hockey rink because it's enclosed and it's safer and salty is old and deaf now so when i say come here he blatantly ignores me because he either can't hear me or he has chosen to not hear me today that one um also, I know it says no dogs, but I make sure they potty first, and I bring bags, and we're really clean about it, and um, thug life. So, we'll, uh, we're gonna go play. We are back from the dog park because holy shit, it was windy. I almost lost the tripod. Like, I'm not saying like the tripod almost fell over. No, like I almost lost the tripod. It was standing and I was trying to get some video of my training techniques with my dogs because I'm really serious about manners. And I was like, hey guys, we're gonna, you know, do some of our normal like training routine that I do when I take them out someplace. And I turned around because I heard like a noise. I was like, what the fuck is that? And I turned around and my tripod is like with the camera and everything skittering across the thing, like towards the entrance, like get away, get away. And I was like, fuck, we gotta go. And even Salty was just like, I'm tired, mama's wind. And it, he gets nervous with like really loud noises. And it's so loud that he's out there like, I don't like this. This is bad, bad wind. So we got some pepperonis and we got a munchkin at Dunkin' Donuts for each of them. And now we are home and I'm gonna go to Home Goods 
because I need buckets to clean my disaster of a closet, which you're gonna see in a moment is not really a closet, it's something else. Um, and then we're probably gonna film some St. Patrick's stuff today, that's exciting. And um, you guys are just gonna hang out with me for the day. I hope you like this. Like if you're having a good time, tell me. Um, I've never really done vlogging before, but I, I kinda enjoy it so far, like it's fun to do. And uh, hang out and we'll keep going. I am a list person. So if it's not on the chalkboard, two-faced honey palette needs to happen in my life, or on the calendar, or on the fridge list, it's not real. Another thing that we're gonna be doing today is it's international. Clean my closet, because I don't have a fucking closet and I have to live in this giant dresser and I have too much shit and I have to go through it today. So we're going to Home Goods to buy some buckets. We did a charity video around Halloween for the Spirit of Children, and we're going to be doing another one soon. It's going to be for the Blue Ocean Marine Society. It's a marine conservation. It is actually run and um, like maintained by a former teacher of mine from high school who's amazing. And we're going to be donating the proceeds from this upcoming video to these guys. So if you're looking for a super cool charity, I have two or three in mind, and um, I'm going to talk about those a little bit later. So I was just starting to eat my bagel and I was thinking about something. I woke up this morning, my anxiety was so bad. It was so bad. I woke up like almost in tears instantly when I woke up. Like I went to the bathroom, came back to bed and cried. Um, and I have, like I have some other stuff going on and stuff like that, but I, and I do have anxiety, like notable anxiety. But I was thinking about this as I'm starting my bagel. I'm like, I don't know too many other people who have anxiety who their first thought after they're like, yeah, I woke up this morning and started sobbing, uh, like, unreasonably upset are like today is the day to start bringing strangers into my life as much as I love you guys I haven't met any of you face to face I don't really know you guys but you're my family and family makes you feel better and you guys are my friends and friends make you feel better and I got up this morning and I was like I'm terribly depressed and I'm super anxious about today let's show some strangers how I live that'll make everything better and um Honestly, focusing on making sure I have my tripod, taking the dogs out, making sure I don't lose my tripod, making sure, you know, that I'm remembering to vlog the things that I want to talk about or the things that I want to show as part of my life has taken my mind off the things that are freaking me out today. And uh, thank you. Appreciate you guys. Uh, if this is something that honestly ends up helping my anxiety, it's something that I could see myself doing a couple of times a week. That's... Uh, this is kind of a neat little discovery there. I thought I'd let you in on that little insight. And uh, I'm gonna go back to this bagel because it's amazing. Hey guys, once again, we are parked. I got a few more errands to run. The important one of the day is get my hands all pretty again. Um, as you can see, I totally jacked up one of my nails and the lovely Miss Lee needs to fix them for me. People look at my hands all day for work and then you guys see me use my hands on YouTube and I just don't like them to be all jacked up like this. So uh, I'll let you know and show you what she does because she's going to make them gorgeous. She always does. Look how super duper glittery they are. So uh, I don't know if this is a worldwide thing or a US thing or a uh, New England thing. But uh, this is Marshall's, and this is where paychecks go to die. I'm gonna go in, and um, this Marshall in particular has like an unbelievable, amazing, freaking fantastic makeup section that has like Anastasia Beverly Hills, and it'll always have like Too Faced and shit like that. So we're gonna go do some digging, and uh, come on, let's go. My new makeup table chair for when I'm working on people because it goes up enough that I'm not killing my back anymore.
I've never managed to walk out of Lowe's without a new hobby. So uh, apparently I'm going to Earth's now. Do you see a shoe rack? Because that's what I came to Lowe's for. Instead, I have pants. Okay, ladies, we are heading directly into the Eye of Sauron. Let's see what the target effect does to me this time. How do I always end up here? Like, seriously. I have a problem. I've been saving up on Amazon for like three months. Target knows what a girl needs. 66 inches of tripod. It legit took me like five minutes to figure out how to put this stupid cup holder on. But it's got a caramel apple spice, so it's all good. Thanks, Target. Appreciate the panic attack. Every time I go to Target, it seems to escape me that I drive a compact car. Like, little car, lots of shit. Tetris time. Can I just say I'm super impressed with myself because I went to Target and I only got one bag and one box and I didn't come out looking like a bag lady. Like, no hoarders here. Right now. Let's not talk about Lowe's. But, uh, on to grocery shopping then it's home to film. Oh, chill, I'm parked. I just wanted to say that Lowe's must have known I was coming because they had my second favorite candy in the whole wide world. The Airhead Extreme Rainbow Bites, the little ones. They're amazing, I just keep them in my car and I'm like, oh, nom, 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 nom. But, first favorite candy is Sour Grape Taffy from the Taffy store in Cape May, New Jersey. These, on the other hand, are like my more accessible splurge food because they're amazing. So I'm back home and I've got a ton of shit to put away, but uh, I think I got everything I wanted to do accomplished today, which is super duper cool because that means I get to, oh, oh hey, hi Choo Choo. That means that I get to do stuff and make videos for you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me, by the way. Appreciate it. The super glamorous life of a YouTuber when she is not filming, it includes cleaning out cabinets all and uh, other fantastical things because I am just as messy as everybody else, if not a little bit more. Um, give me a few more minutes to clean this and then clean something else, and then we're gonna do a little filming McFilming stance of hopefully my face, maybe. I'm fucking tired. We'll get there. We're gonna do this. We're holding out till the end on this one. Hey fam, it's uh, it's pretty late. I'm about to go to bed to bed. Thank you for spending time hanging out with me and shopping with me and doing stuff with me. Um, I was gonna do some filming, but I had other stuff that kind of got in the way and uh, I just, my anxiety was not good today, but I really enjoyed doing this. And if you guys enjoyed watching it, let me know and uh, I'll continue to do filming. For now, it's uh, bedtime. I thought I would at least give you the heads up, though, that I solved the not a closet situation with some pretty racks that went up on the back of a door to create a linen closet and pretty baskets to put all my jeans away in. But, uh, till then, check you later. <laughs>